Hi, this is Joel Persinger. I'm the Gun Guy. Thank you very much for watching my videos. I really do appreciate your support. Yes, I know. I have one revolver left. That's it. And then I'm done with revolvers for a while until I find another cool one, and then I'll probably bring it up. Listen, this is my favorite double-action revolver, um, other than my Model 10. I really like the Smith & Wesson Model 10 as far as shooting is concerned. But this one honestly tops that one, and the reason for it mainly is that, well, first of all, the SP-101 by Ruger is a tremendous handgun. It really is a great pistol. Uh, the other thing is that this was my dad's. You know, my dad was a great guy, and, and he, he wasn't perfect. Nobody is. I'm not either. But he was a terrific dad, and I, I really miss him a lot. He's been gone for quite a long time, and unfortunately, he never got to meet my kids. He died before my kids were born. This gun was his. He had the original grip on it. He was a little smaller than me. He was a big guy, but he was a little shorter than me. And his, he, he liked the smaller grip. I, I don't. I've got big hands. So I swapped the grip out because the original grip kind of drove me crazy. And it, every time I'd shoot magnums with it, the original grip would let the, the uh, trigger guard bang up against my knuckle and pound the snot out of me. So I put these hoe grips on it, and now it's really a joy to shoot. Having said that, uh, it doesn't conceal as well. But then, truthfully, I don't carry it anyway because it's my dad. So the last thing I want to do is have to defend myself with the stupid thing and then and then have police officers want to take it for evidence that I may never see it again. So I don't use it for any of those purposes. This is a, a gun that I take out and shoot because I enjoy taking it out to shoot. And periodically, um, you know, I'll, I'll carry it hunting, maybe, as a sidearm if I know I'm going to go on long hikes and I just need something that's got some oomph just in case. Uh, I might take it for that. But that's about it. I do, however, shoot it quite frequently because I thoroughly enjoy shooting it. Now, if you're looking for a carry gun, I don't know that you could get one that's better as far as revolvers are concerned with this one proviso, and that is it's heavy. Ruger tends to overbuild everything, and this thing is built like a tank. You could run it over with your car or your truck and pick it up, and it probably would still go. Uh, it is the... This one, and I would say the GP100 by Ruger, and maybe the Security 6. I mean, all the Ruger revolvers are just, they're just built phenomenally well, and this is no exception. The trigger in it now, because I've shot it so much, and, and my dad shot it a lot, is very nice and smooth. They're a little rough when you first get them, but I think that's the case with most revolvers, with the exception of the Colt Python. That thing had a beautiful trigger out of the box. But this thing is, is really a phenomenal gun. It's stainless, which I thoroughly enjoy. It, is, it, it handles magnum rounds with a plume. I mean, it's just no big deal to shoot magnums through this thing. It's extremely comfortable. It doesn't beat you up. You know, it jumps more than a heavier gun would be. But honestly, as when I get into the little five-shot 357 magnums, I would say this is by far the easiest one to shoot because of its weight. However, if you're going to carry it as a pocket gun, nah, it's too heavy, even if you get the two-inch version. Uh, as an ankle gun... Uh, I'd be walking funny because I got this big weight on my ankle. It's a little too heavy. If it's in a strong side hip holster, could you carry it all day? Sure. But I don't know that it fits those other things that my Taurus would do, which is much lighter. Uh, however, if you don't mind the weight and you want a revolver that you can carry concealed, boy, that's the one right there because that thing will never do you wrong. It will always do you right, and it will always do the bad guy horribly wrong if you put great ammunition in it. As it's, it's really a terrific revolver, and, it, and again, because it was my dad's and it's such a great gun, it is easily one of my favorites. So there you are. There's the Ruger SP-101. This one has a 3-inch barrel, or I think it's just a tad shorter than 3-inch. You can get them in 2-inch and longer. It's a 5-shot stainless steel revolver, and again, I put the hoe grips on it because my hands, as you can see, are pretty big. And with the little, uh, the smaller grip, it beat my knuckle up. But with this hoe grip, wow, it's it's comfortable, fits me like a glove, and I thoroughly enjoy shooting it. And it's a great heirloom too. So if you happen to have one that uh, that you want to carry, it you're not going to do any better. Other than like I said, it's just kind of heavy. That's it. There's the Ruger SP-101. I wanted to show it to you again because I was enamored with my revolvers this month for some crazy reason. I don't know why. I like to shoot them a lot, and I figured I'd just share that with you. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I urge you to continue doing that. If you need concealed carry insurance or home defense insurance for firearms, 
Second Call Defense is an absolutely awesome choice. That is the company I use, and I urge you to check them out. Obviously, they sponsor the channel, so, and so they've made me a recruiter. So if you happen to sign up through our link, then we get a little bit of uh, remuneration from that. That would be called money. Uh, likewise, if you shop Amazon, even though they're not a very gun-friendly company, I mean, if you shop them, you might as well get some money out of them for gun-friendly things. You can do that through our link on Gun Guy TV, and they'll pay us a commission. It doesn't cost you anything, but it, uh, it is a great way to help out the channel. And please check us out on Patreon. There you go. I did my commercials. Thank you very much for the opportunity to do that. Have a wonderful week, and please be safe.